Yeah. <laughs> Yo. Let's see. Hey, let me show y'all something. What's my favorite color this weekend? It's blue. <laughs> I love blue. You're a damn smurf. Hey, cold shoulder kicks got me feeling like I won the lotto. Might just have to ice out on my wrist. This AK fully auto. I've been balling like I'm Katie or McGrady on Toronto. Grim function. Yo, this camera's way better than TY's. Hey, what's I'm up? Winner of season nine, Tell Kitchen. Huh. That's fine. We have salt. What's going on, shoulder boys? We're out here. We're loaded up. It's like probably like 7 a.m. We're probably like an hour late already, but like that's how we roll fashionably. Like, Gibby, you got trousers on, Bowser. <sighs> I lost my glasses and I can't stop thinking no, about it. <laughs> they might be in the car. Hopefully they are. I guess we'll keep you updated. You see that, Iggy? Honestly, not really. I'm holding the camera. Sunset, My glasses are in the car, so I'm no longer gonna be a sketch ball all day. I can relax. So, we're on our way. We're late already, but we're making it there. We're about to go get food from McDonald's for everyone, and they're gonna wait in line. Oh, let's see how, line this, how long this line's gonna be today. I bet you it's gonna be a mob. Yo, what up? I'm behind you. Oh, really? Yeah. You have a table? Yeah. You have an extra vendor pass? Uh, no, unfortunately. We only have four. And all four you came? Yup. What's good? We got the boy Alejandro. Yo, run your fit down. Shit, the everyday fit. Got a black essentials tee. <laughs> Some $50 pants. The 450s that I wear every day. Got the 5711. A few Cubans. A few Cubans. We out here. What's on my head? I got this from cold shoulders. <laughs> you actually did. Oh. Every time you recorded a sneaker event, I look absolutely exhausted. I probably look exhausted right now too. I'm sorry. Actually, I'm not. I don't give a f This is wrong. Get on This is wrong is what it is. Too sharp, please. We tow our shit, bro. About to be Lobo City. Yo, uh, I should ask him, right? Yeah. Let me ask him. Like, I can show the YouTube the slash shoes real quick. Oh yeah, sure, I got you, bro. So, I go on eBay, you know, save my hard-earned money to get a pair of new kicks, bro. Like VNDS, and they came with no box from eBay, and my mom, very reckless, got the box cutter and sliced my shoes. Yep, so, on the off-white dunks, bro. Oh. Yeah, right. <laughs> First person to come to him. But hey, bro, you mind doing a fit check for me? Fit check? All right, so got the cactus plant flea market crew neck. Go um, size down on this one. I'm a large, I got a medium. Cargo pants and mummy dumps. Which are pretty fire. Most underrated SP. Fucking, I love your blazers, bro. Hey, appreciate it, bro. Thank you. Thank God. Yes, sir. You already know the big boy had to come in with the food. Big boy. Yo, those patents? So, the boy brought some pairs over. Will he wear any of these? At the table. Huh? Let me take pictures of these real quick. We're sending them to the boy. You know he likes some crazy heat, so. Today I got a kid's Star Wars tee. We saw this the other day. Uh, minimal pants with the brown. Unions on the feet as always. Pro parts hat. And their usual jewelry. That's it. Pro Marts hat, you know what it is. Get that V-Loan Old English. Just some, uh, I don't know, h and Oxford Tans. These are probably my favorite shoes right now. And then, yeah, that's it. All right, you guys, I'm Bryson with the Common Hype. We're gonna do a quick little fit check right here. So I got my camera, you guys already know. 
little vintage shoe right here with some color on the back. Just some plain pants today and then the uh, turbo ones. I don't got as much ice as this guy. <laughs> it looks like he's eating a little bit rich, but I got a little bit of something. <laughs> no, you got some fire stuff. I love the bracelet though. Appreciate cool. it, man. Thank you guys. Where are we at? Sneaker con. Cold shoulder. <laughs> Alright, that's going in YouTube. Leave it in. Alright, anyways, what are we wearing? Chrome necklace? Yeah. Good talking. White tee, uh, H&M, I don't know. A little bit of jewelry, Prada bag. Got some trousers on with a little pants chain, you already know. They speak for themselves. I watch It's almost set. It's supposed to say a damn size. Show them what we got. Why not? Alright guys, we're, we set everything up, we're waiting for the event to open, we open at, they open at 12 o'clock, we just bought a cause candle for $40, shit's fire though. Can't we also complain. got PEs. Got PEs, three of them. Cause candles and PEs. Ten and a half, ten and a half, and eleven. What is that? Yo, call Caleb. My pants. Away. Two for sixty. Carhartt Car jeans. Where are they at? Ooh, we needed those. Over there, dude. Fire vintage. I go Permits there. done. Everything thirty bucks, forty Two. bucks. Can you run? I'm gonna go Shout out to yeah. And I got nut. Lemonade. Check this out. They sell glazed nuts here. Really? Yes, and lemonade. We do love your nuts. Wow, I'm gonna get some nuts. All right, so we're at Pirate Selection right now. We got the booth. We just bought some merch. Bailey just picks up some merch. Had some fire pieces. We just brought him just to show everybody. Come on, Joe. I can do it. Nice to meet you, man. I did. Was Fat Joe, right? Yeah. All right, I'm leaving this here. All right. So we're with the boy Larry from Private Selection. You already know he's about to run his fit down. Always full fit. Head to toe. Full fit, Larry. You already know. We're selling the merch today, so I had to go full fit PCH. Please come home from the top. The hoodie, shorts, got the little mesh hit with the socks, with the 2005 dunks that I got from Eric from Band LA when we went to LA a couple months ago. They matched the hoodie perfect. So I had to hit everybody with the merch today just so you can see what you're getting. So What's the jewelry? What are you rocking? Man, oh, I mean, the jewelry isn't anything. I got the 41 millimeter Rolex my wedding ring nice little ring here got the little cardi bracelet got the texaco piece i dreamed about this since i was 14 years old i i bought it when i was 35 and then you got your private keep privates all the way around 3d diamonds all the way around and then the first in the original the pch Yo, what's up? Yo, what's up? Yo, how you been, man? God bless. I'm out here buying some sneakers. You know what I'm saying? I'm a sucker for sneakers, you know? What's up, buddy? Yeah, I know, I see him, I see him. Hey, you got a sale. You got a sale. trying to get Steve on the phone. You're going out there, Steve. I'm going to get the phone out of the phone. It's not bad. Just got to see you. Oh my God, let me show you all this thing. Bro, bro, I got 5,000 credits. It's open the store. It's all good. Testing, testing. You just open the store? Where we're at? I'm going to go. I'm going to go. All right, give me more wheels. I'm going to let you talk to you. What? Let me get y'all right out now. Hey, look at the phone. So I'm with my boy here. You already know. What's good, y'all? My name is Figs. I'm from Charlotte, North Carolina. Uh, I heard this was the fit check, so we rocking pair number 22. We got a lot of them, but only kept the favorite ones. You got like, uh, you got like all 50. Uh, I only actually have up to number 39 because the rest are China and I can't wear them. They're all, they don't make a 13. Really? Bro, there's not a sale on StockX. Nothing. It makes me sick, yeah. <laughs> and this is the first white t-shirt I've worn in like the past like three years. And I'm in Florida, it was a really bad idea because we'd be sweating out here, but, <laughs> but yeah. Shout out to Cold Shoulder Kicks, these guys are the man. Appreciate it, bro. You already know. Have a good one. So I'm with my boy here, Max. He's about to run down the fit. You already know he's got something crazy on. Show him what you got. All right, all right, it's so on the feet. We got the, the 
Mr. Rex, the gallery, the Flair Carpenters, Coronavirus T, well, GMT on the Batman, right. well, Cuban, and the leather craft, leather cross hey. chrome hat. Don't forget the backpack. Oh shit, chrome backpack. Jeez. It's light, it's light. You should know better, you should make your way back there, move those cars. Anybody? Do I think? Yeah. yeah, yeah. You wanna know why? Anybody saw anything from behind the table? You wanna know why? Mm. They can't. Sheesh. So. Nine this, is round, this is round one. Yeah. Is this before the event started? We're about to do round two. When the event starts. Yes, sir. Got my boy Marcos here. Saw a crazy pair on feet. Had to get it on camera. Sir. Holy shit. Sir. <laughs> huh? It's just sunny in here. <laughs> those are crazy, bro. Appreciate it, bro. Appreciate it. Yeah, those are fine. But you want to break down the fit real quick? Yes, sir. Um, so we got a little vintage piece from yesterday's fits from Vegas. Oh, yeah. Um, we have some Elwood shorts, uh, gallery department socks. Oh, yeah. That's a yes, crazy sir. pair, bro. Fire. Yes, Glad sir. to see you towing them. So, oh, what's your name, bro? Austin. Austin, I'm Gib. Nice to meet you, bro. Nice to meet you. Go ahead, break down the fit. Oh shit. Uh, we doing prices or we just talking yeah, about? Yeah, run price, run price. Oh, run it up, run it up. Alright, so I got the Louis bag. We're looking at about 400, so 90s. Looking at the Fast and Furious all over print. Looking, I paid like 100 for it. Uh, simple ass pants, and then we got uh, the custom 10 off white forces. Oh. Were they beat when you customized them? No, they're, they were dead stock. They're, they're gonna oh, come in with that's, that's oh, crazy. Man. Yeah, I got I did it right when they first came out, so the price wasn't Nothing too high crazy, on them. Right? Yeah. You just held them now, they're like three bands though, right? Yeah. No, you, I've never seen someone with poker. No. Have you gotten anybody like offered to buy this? Uh, I got an offer two grand on somebody. Yeah. And I was in I was in San Jose in SneakerCon there. Wow. That's but pretty generous. Very. Yeah. I, was, I, uh, I would I would have done it, but it was a gift on them, the the custom on it, so but hell yeah. Bye, bro. Appreciate you guys. Yeah, man. I know there's some catching up. No, they're not mags. They just look like it. I thought they were mags at first, and oh, I ran over here. I don't know what they're called. I don't know who it is. I don't even got to say no, it. I have. I'm sorry. Let me... oh, Yo, good. Max. Hey, record this for my channel, too. All right, so I'm going to let you all know. Today, I'm finally rocking a different outfit. So it seems like we're going to get approached for some fit checks. Yes, sir. So I'm going to go through it with y'all real quick because this is a different outfit today. This is some fire. I don't even need to tell y'all who this is, you know. But go ahead, man. Break down this fit. So we got a little vintage action. Normally, I'm always wearing some blazonary gear, but today I'm like, I want to go simple, clean, casual. And I got these Heron Preston pants. They don't really fit, though. So I kind of had to just like put them at the bottom, you know, whatever. I got the plats on foot. Normally got the mags, but... The plaits are my favorite Yeezy, so gotta rep them, and I'm trying to keep them wearable. If you don't wear them, they're just gonna crumble. Yep. And then I got some jewelry. We got the Roly, just a little bit of ice here and there. Nice. Don't forget the bag. Don't forget the uh, bag. We got the bag. We got yes, the LV, sir. the Galaxy. This was I don't know if this was Kim Jones or if this was Virgil, but it was one of them. Uh, it's doing well in the resale right. market. Yo, that's funny you say that. One of your videos I watched so long ago, you had a Kim Jones bag, the upside down one. Yeah, the LV. And yeah, since yeah. I saw that, I like that one is so bad. Dude, they you have put me onto that for real. they have some crazy stuff when they have the right designer in there. Yeah. And I think, what do you think that what's gonna happen with the Virgil stuff, like the Virgil Nikes that they're coming out with, with the LV? It's not gonna be the same, I don't think. It's still oh, the ones that are already coming out, the Air Forces. Yeah. No, those are straight. They're fire. They're fire. But after that. I don't know what they're gonna be able to do. Did you hear that Ye was gonna pick up the creative I directing? You think he will? I don't know. I hear people were not too happy about that I one. Saw that, yeah. Because the gap, dude, that gap jacket is. Have you seen it? Dude? Pretty garbage compared to how it's supposed to be, you know? The hoodies, fire. The jackets, whack. Yeah, right? Plastic. We'll see. Garbage. But hey, this turned into a multi layered yeah, interview. Right? <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy. Have a great rest of your day, SneakerCon. Sign it out, stay positive. Hey, peace out. So we're gonna run down my top three at our booth currently. Um, I'm gonna have to go with as a number one, the four. Then second, I would have to go with a mocha just because it's a good colorway and I love this shoe. And then last but not least, off-white lot. This is lot three. I like the purple, the lavender, and it's all kind of like monotone, which is nice. I wish it was suede. Other than that, it's a fire shoe.
It's like a full run. I don't think I'll be duplicates. One eight and a half. So how much if I take both eights and one and eight and a half? How much? If I take both eights and the one eight and a half. Uh, run two ninety per. Uh, what are you looking for? I'm trying to get like stock ticks or under. Like ask? Yeah. Yeah, I can't do that. Sorry, man. Yeah. It is what it is. So right now, I'm trying to find myself a nine and a half. Travis Scott or a nine or a ten even lightly worn and for a decent price like I, I'll play market but I ain't paying no crazy number a lot of these people want crazy numbers let's see right here we might have found it this looks too big 12 unfortunately how much did you want for these Some guy, if that was my size, I would definitely buy. Some guy wants like 1500 for a nine over there, like this condition. Oh, and it's used? Yeah. yeah I mean, you might the get it. lowest ask is like 15 for that size, so 12 is pretty fair. No, I that's good for that size. And that's good condition. Yeah. Okay. We're having trouble finding these pairs. I've been looking at every booth almost. Everyone has either dead stock, not my size, or they're asking the moon. How much are you asking? I'm honestly not even trying to sell them. Really? I feel that, bro. Yo. Yo. Yo, what's good, everyone? It's your boy, Tyler. We finally got to the convention center. I gave Adrian my vendor pass. Never again. I just waited in line for an hour. That sucked ass. But uh, now we're here. My first sneaker con. Childhood dream come true for sure. My phone is ringing. Oh, it's Gibby. We left for two seconds. Yeah, Gib. First year. He's like, oh, shit. You care if I take these out? Yeah, go ahead. Oh, shit. That was sad. What's good? We here at SneakerCon. Got these. Show me your shirt. Came correct. Hell yeah. You already know. Fuck yeah. Since day one. Howdy. What do you need? I got some shoes. I was gonna put them in the middle. Pick something out. I'll take a bar. For what pairs do you want? We can work something out. Logan, what's good, my boy? No, 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 no. Hey, Gib. What's up, bro? What's up, man? You're the guy. Remember in the group chat? Yeah. How you doing? Right now. Joe's getting some numbers together. He wants some pairs. We're gonna make it happen. What pairs you got? We always make it work. We're gonna make it work. We're in Fort Lauderdale today, not Palm Beach. West Palm Beach. Not Palm Beach. That's what we're Fucking trip. It's good, baby. Hey, look what he got on. Yeah, we um jersey swapped. Yeah. I got the. I gave him that. You gave me this. That's hilarious. What the guy's best is on a pair of Travis's. See if you can get it. That was some high mochas. No box. Ten, size 10. He's asking $1,500. We're gonna try to get him for $20. Oh. Hey, bro. Can I see the Travis? Yeah, for sure. I guess one. Uh, I guess two. Look a little weird. Oh, it's because of the eyes. Hello? We got no internet, so you gotta rely on our eyeballs. Not good. <laughs> oh. I don't know, everything checks off. Yeah. Like, Fishing's just a little weird to me. Where'd you pick them up at? Uh, actually, another resale so to Don't think about it. You got just this? Yeah. No uh, laces, nothing? No, no laces. I got a replacement box for an AC. Yeah. Oh, man. I appreciate it. Yeah, for sure. It was going crazy. Oh well, I got here late. I didn't know the show opened up at 7 in the fucking morning. I got here at like 10. All the boys got here hella early. I can't remember. Uh, like, uh, of course, it'll be Justin Bieber now. Ooh, okay. Oh, that's true, my son. Right New? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Damn. Boys wearing a chandelier. Rolex. <laughs> Where's mine at? Where's mine? You gotta tell Jules, my wrist is looking bare. Come on, Jules. I'm gonna have to sell it. I'm gonna have to sell it because it's. 
time I come in, I buy, and you always text me. You're 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 a menace. I'm in your head. Yo, it's okay. Yo, on the next video of D coming to the shop, he's gonna trade the Rolex for 12 pairs. That's crazy. So we just did a coin flip for retail for Eric Emanuel shorts, 110, 115. He won. So 115. We got your revenge. Last time he lost in store. So Ty, I see a stack of shoes missing. Uh, we just sold all of our bubble gums. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I guess we only have seven pairs left. I was a little late to the event. I guess I sold some before. Uh, but yeah, seven pairs going to one guy. Not a bad day. So just sold the carpet companies a minute ago. And you checking out some PEs. We got some Michigan three PEs too right behind you. Fire ass pair. Uh, hey, yo, you can show the threes off with the camera. You already know who's here. Eric's back. He's back again with. Yeah, today the outfit from the top. I customized this. This is a World War II military patch. We've got the Yeezy shirt, CPFM flannel, vintage Levi's, and then down to the feet. Big heat on the feet today with the Joe Fresh goods. Bye. Rolex on the wrist, Cartier on the wrist. Ben Baller did the chain, baby. <laughs> this is the first, well actually this is the second Nike collab that Kanye had. The first one is the Air Max that never got released. These are the Zens. These are the Blinks, black and pink. And these are the Tans. These were all released in between the years like 2008 to like 2012, I think. Don't quote me on it. And then this is a sample pair. It's called size 4. What size? Size 8. What size? A little bit of crazy heat, a little sneaker con, a local sneaker show. Yeah. I'm vibing. What's up, Gabe? Hello. What's up, baby? CS Kicks, man. Best table at sneaker con. <laughs> Is that a 5500 ST? What is that? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, so Wow. I don't know. I forgot. Alright, what's good guys? We got the boys here. Um, they're about to run down their fits. I'm Danny. This is my little brother Ethan. Ethan. Unrevealed, baby. Have a good one. Are we doing a fit Yeah, check? you can do a fit check. Alright. Christian Dior t-shirt. I think it was like 600. Yeah. Bags 4K. Sheesh. Jeans, page jeans, 350. Uh, I think these were like 12, 1300. And 14 karat. I have no idea how many grams yeah. this is, but it was like 30K, 25K, 5K. Oh, how are we doing? Bitch? Yeah. Are we doing? Oh, come on. You picked up the memo. Oh, no, you picked no. up the memo. You got the oh, gun. Okay, all right. Well, we got <laughs> we got my initial thirty thousand with my my date of birth. Twenty five thousand for the tennis old VS kilo chain eleven hundred grams with the diamonds Royal Oak hundred thousand uh, Cartier bust down forty thousand uh, two hundred fifty gram VS that thing is ridiculous. Rose gold. Uh, I don't even know. I think I paid 25, 30,000 for that, maybe even more. Chicago off whites, Mary jeans, Mary shirt, chrome hard hat. Yes, sir. All right, so we're with the man, the legend, Two J's. He decided to do a quick bit with us. Just wanted to let him speak. Nah, man, just here hanging out at SneakerCon Fort Lauderdale with the guys, you know, and he's sitting here telling me the backstory about the brand, and, and it's dope, man. I'm excited for you guys, and I wish you the best. I appreciate it. Yeah, no worries. We always see you talk about, like, advice for resellers starting, right? So what would you give advice to a new a new shop owner dealing with the clientele? A new shop owner? Uh, get you a good accountant and apply for every possible piece of credit that you think is beneficial to you, right? Whether that's through PayPal loans, bank loans, credit card loans, like, like, look, most of America was built with other people's money. Definitely. Makes sense, you know? So, and other people's not your own. And just try to get as many credit cards that have rewards for you 
from, you know, travel miles, book your stuff through, like, credit cards and get those extra points and, and, and use that to your benefit. Yeah. Try to cut your overhead as much as you can and keep life as much as you can. Yeah. Really appreciate it. Wish you guys the best. Thank you so much. Thank you. Take care. Yo, we just finished. This is all we got left. Show them, please. We had a lot more. Actually, show them this. This is better. $30 Levi uh, Dickies, sorry, denim. Mom. Yo. Thank you guys for tuning in to another Cold Shoulder episode. It was Sneaker Con, it was amazing. We met a bunch of dope people on Network, sold a bunch of pairs, and we're going to Sneaker Exit tomorrow, so you'll see that also in this video or the next one. And we'll catch you in the next video. Make sure you like, subscribe. What else, kid? That's all. It's a wrap. <laughs> Cold shoulder kicks got me feeling like I won the lotto. Might just have to ice out on my wrist. This AK fully auto. I've been balling like I'm Katie or McGrady on Toronto. Never gave up.